Hey, good evening to you. And now for something completely different. Windshields on Indy cars? Not quite, but it's all in the name of safety, and really, who's going to argue against that? The future is bright, and it is now in the Sports Extra Spotlight. Standing still, it is sleek, almost artistic. But when it gets up to speed, it may be the biggest innovation in IndyCar safety in a generation. It's quite exciting, but this is a total, to me, it's an industry-changing total driver safety solution. Like Andy said, it's, it's all of it, right? So um, we couldn't be more proud of this. I mean, this to me is a game changer. This is big. IndyCar's new aero screen safety system combines a titanium halo with a clear polycarbonate shield. It's designed to protect drivers' heads from flying debris and getting rave reviews from Tuesday's initial run. I'm so happy that we have it. It's really a huge step in safety. And, um, you know, I think it's, it's the best of both worlds. You've got the halo and you've got a screen. So, you know, I, I think that uh, when you've driven it for, for a day, you're going to feel naked without it. Aside from changing the aesthetics, the screen affects nearly every aspect of the car. The downforce, tire wear, fuel mileage, all will be analyzed thoroughly. Inside the car, there's an interesting additional change as well. Uh, ultimately, it's just very quiet. Um, you can hear the, I can hear my radio for a change. Uh, normally, I can't hear that, uh, so that's quite, kind of nice. As for keeping these aero screens clean, there will be two solid options. Tearaways, similar to those on driver's visors, and good old-fashioned elbow grease. Drivers are quite moany, right? So you want it off all the time. And I'm like that when I do the endurance races, and, and you got to be very picky on when they take it off. IndyCar will also test the screen this fall at Barber, Richmond, and Sebring. Come next May, it's clear that drivers will have a new view around here. Yeah, I didn't know what to expect. I was a little bit claustrophobic when I went out at first. Then I was like, then you just, yeah, you, know, you get used to it now. You don't want it without it. At the Speedway, Brad Brown, RTV6 Sports.